Hey everyone, welcome to today's video. Today we are going to be covering the question, how do I get the basic setup for Omni Studio document generation in Revenue Cloud? The steps that we are going to cover include installing the Omni Studio package, setting up permission sets for document generation, configuring document template library access, setting up document generation settings, creating data mappers, creating document template designs, using integration procedures to generate documents, and generating documents at the click of a button. First off, we need to prepare your org for installation. Before you begin, ensure your Salesforce org is fully prepared for Omni Studio installation by following the prerequisite and setup guidelines. This will be linked in the description below. Next, you will go ahead and install Omni Studio. You will go to Salesforce and search for the Omni Studio or Salesforce Industry Package. Follow the installation prompts to install the package. If you are attempting to upgrade the version of Omni Studio in your org, you may need to reach out to Salesforce support through a case to get the new version of the package. Once installed, we will need to follow the post installation setup. You will configure Omni Studio components like Omni Scripts, data mappers, integration procedures, and document generation settings. To enable user access to document generation features, you will need to assign appropriate permission sets. You will do this by navigating to setup and go and search for the users that will need permissions. You will then need to give them the permission sets, doc gen designer, this will be for creating and modifying document templates and DocGen user, and this will be for them to generate the documents. To use document generation in Revenue Cloud, we need to set up document template libraries. Document template libraries are managed in Salesforce Classic. Here's how to set them up properly. We'll first need to switch to Salesforce Classic. You can do this by going to the top right corner and selecting Switch to Salesforce Classic. You will then access libraries and click the plus button in the navigation menu and select libraries. You will then need to create or, and locate, either create or locate the document template library. You will make, need to make sure that this library is named docgen document template library. You will need to make sure that this library is shared with anyone that will need to use document generation. The best way to do this is through extending these permissions through a public group. Next, we'll need to configure the settings for document generation. In Salesforce setup, search for document generation settings. Complete the configuration form with the necessary details to activate document generation for your organization. You can use the screenshot here to make sure it is set up correctly. Next, we will need to create data mappers. Data mappers are crucial for extracting and transforming data for document generation. We'll need to create two data mappers. We need to create an extract data mapper to pull the relevant data and a tr transform data mapper. This will, will use this to tr transform data into a format that can then be used in our document template designer. When creating the transform, we will want to select the output as document template. This will allow us to map the data from the extract to the document template tokens. Next up is our document templates. Document templates define how your documents will look and what dynamic data they will include. To create a document template in Document Template Designer, you will open the app launcher and search Document Template Designer. We'll click New to create a new template. We will select the ext extract and transform data mappers that we previously created. Next, we need to follow the steps shown in the screenshot below for any additional configuration. Another crucial part to the setup are the integration procedures. Integration procedures are used in Omni Studio to orchestrate complex processes, processes such as generating documents via Apex and integrating with external services. Step one, we'll create an integration procedure. In Salesforce, Set up, go to Omni Studio Integration Procedures. Click Net, click New to create a new integration procedure. Step two, we'll add a remote action to call the Apex class for document generation. 
We'll add a remote action to call the document service gateway apex class. We'll pass the necessary parameters to the apex method as shown in the screenshot. Step three will be to activate the integration procedure. Once an integration procedure and Apex class are set up, document generation can be triggered via various methods, such as buttons, flows, or automation. Most often, we will see Apex actions being used in flows. The system will generate the document based on the selected templates and populate it with dynamic data. The document will be provided in the specified format, for example, Word or PDF. And that's it. With these steps, you're well on your way to successfully configuring Omni Studio document generation in Revenue Cloud. If you have any questions or need a deeper dive into any area of Salesforce, let us know. Check us out at solve.cloud to learn how we can help automate your business or join our AI webinars found on our website. And please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more insights. See you next time. And thank you.